Hey everyone, it's Maki and welcome finally to Portal 2. So I'm very excited to play this game because every single one of you in the comment sections have been hyping this game since I played the first one. You guys have been telling me that it's longer and better in every single way possible. So now my expectations are way above the roof. So hopefully this game exceeds those expectations. Last time we left off, we were actually successful in our quest to destroy GLaDOS and escape the facility until this kind of service robot actually dragged our unconscious body back inside Aperture. But in the graphic novel called Lab Rat, which I read in the previous video, he actually saved us by placing us inside this sort of cryo suspension chamber where we're in a state of eternal sleep and we pretty much don't know when we're going to wake up so now i don't even know where the story is going to begin or how the story is going to begin what's the plot where is it going to start what else is new for this game but i am all up for it some of you have mentioned that this game has a lot more dialogue compared to the first one and that i should actually take my time so that i'm able to listen to every single dialogue and that's what we're going to do I want that portal lore guys i want to absorb every single lore i can i want to know everything and know the story so yeah i'm not going to hold you guys any longer and let's jump right in Good whoa you have been in suspension for 50 days in compliance with 50 days that's a long time candidates in the aperture science extended relaxation center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise is this a cryo suspension? This looks like the same room. Look up at the ceiling. Wait, the graphics looks good. Wait, did they update the graphics? This actually looks way better. Or am I just tripping? It actually feels much more smoother too. Wow, they definitely improved on the, the game. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Okay, look down at the floor. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Not gonna lie, guys, this kind of this room looks garbage. I'm not, I'm sorry, guys. I I mean I'm not one to talk. My room is literally just a huge white rectangle, but you know, it is what it is. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Okay, I'll stare at the art. Oh, that's actually really good. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, we're starting. Yep, this is Portal, all right. This is it. This is Portal. Let me just actually check the area if there is anything I could interact with. I don't know. I'm not sure. So, wow, this is the cryo suspension chamber. Interesting. I recognize the, the plan and the window from the novel. Good morning. You have been in suspension for Oh my god. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Wheatley. Hello, Wheatley. Anytime. Hello? No. Are you going to open this door? Because it's, fa it's fairly urgent. Wow, he's actually saying a lot. Well, just open the door. <laughs> Hello, friend. I'm sorry, I... Could be. I'm Filipino. Close, close. No, um... Fine. No. For absolutely fine. It's not like I don't have, you know, 10,000 other test subjects <laughs> begging me to help them escape. You know, it's not like this place is about to explode. All right, look, okay, I'll be honest. You're the last test subject left. And if you don't help me, we're both going to die. Oh, my God. So I, I love this guy already. Dragged it out of me. All right, dead. Dos muerte. But it's actually the first person who has been talking in the entire game. I mean, the entire Hello. kind of... Hello. Franchise. Open the door. Okay, okay, I'm gonna open the door. Oh, oh wait. You look, it's uh. Um, good, looking good actually. Are you okay? <laughs> are, are you? Don't, 
that. It's not a person. I thought it was a person. Plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. Calm. Okay, okay. I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm chill. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Oh my god, look at the bed. I imprinted on it. Oh, there goes the room. Can you hear me? Hello? I'm assuming we're still playing as Shell, hopefully. If we're continuing from the, the first game. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer. Yeah, 99999. That you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. <laughs> okay, dude. All right. Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarm, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying? True. Does any of this make any sense? That's actually just true. Just say yes. Speak. Okay. What you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you, just, <laughs> you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay. Am I actually gonna say it? <laughs> okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. Wait, she actually doesn't talk. I like how that's a that's kind of like an inside joke in Portal now. Whoa! Okay, look, I wasn't hey, hey, hang on, hang on. Pretty hot water here. How you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Oh wow! Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Dude, look at this place. Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge Yeah, of. that's why Doug couldn't save us. Look right, at this place. Folks, couldn't even reach us. Am I gonna make it through? But I love space. I think you're good. You're good, my guy. Just, just gotta get through here. Oh my god. I, I just gotta concentrate. Relax, relax, Who's buddy. Small? gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables. <laughs> all right, so no, I hit that one. I hit that one. Are they all dead? Am I the last one? Okay, listen. Oh my god, look at this. Straight, all right, if anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right, <laughs> not dead. Okay, well... On the other side of that wall... Everyone looks kind of dead. Tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. It says 500 feet below, dude. Good news. That is not a docking station. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna attempt a map oh my god. It says below 500 feet. Hold on. Almost there. Remember, <laughs> you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on. Alright, I will, I will, I will. Whoa. Wow, everything is literally smooth. I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, <laughs> at least you're a good jumper. So you've got that. You've got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best and I'll meet you up ahead. He's still riding on the fact that we have brain damage, bro. That's the spirit. I'm a good jumper. Got it. You gonna say anything else? More dialogue? Hmm. Wow. He kind of... I don't know why. Is, is it just me or... He's very expressive for like... It's probably the eye, right? Like the eye moving and all? Wow. Actually, you did a really good job. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment. Oh, wait! I know this! ...experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Wait, so they have a protocol in case of an apocalypse, but they don't have protocol for when GLaDOS literally fucking poisons them with neurotoxin? What the fuck? Am I still shell, actually? Let me check. 
Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, that's, that's definitely Shell. That, I'm still Shell. Whoa. Dude, look at this place. Literally overgrown. Wow. Cube and button based testing. Oh, I know this. Tool for science, even in a dire emergency. Our first puzzle. Cube and button based testing caused this emergency. Don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Okay. Pretty sure it didn't cause the emergency. Nope. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture size. No. I remember this. Unauthorized equipment that passes through it. I'm sorry, radio. Wait, this looks different. What happened to the elevator? Whoa. This is new. Wow, okay. New elevator, I guess. I kind of miss the old one. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Huh? What do you mean? The fuck? Oh my god, look at this. Environment is crazy. Wow, guys. Let me just take a, take a few seconds to admire this. Uh, okay. This should be easy, right? Pick this up. Place it where the button is. Drop it. And we're good. We're golden. Wait, how do I... Oh, wait. There's a button there. I was about to fail my second test. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. So is this also like a sentient being like GLaDOS or is it literally just more AI? Is literally just a harmless if testing robot protocol? Animal king, sending a cloud or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Oh. Animal king takeover. That is a big ass turret, dude. Oh my god, that is a huge turret. That's insane. Okay, I think I... Hey, oh, hello, Wheatley. There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Okay. I can't see it, though. Maybe it fell off. It's not here. Oh! Jesus Christ, that scared me. Hello? Can you see the portal gun? I can't. Are you alive? That's exactly <laughs> uh, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive. And I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. <laughs> I'll, wait, I'll wait one hour. Then I'll come back. And assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. Nope. Okay. Yep. Brilliant. Thank you. Hello, Thank you. Yep. See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not. <laughs> Yeah, okay, I can definitely see why this game has a lot more dialogue now. Whoa. Wait, this is, uh, Doug's Graffiti. So here we have the scientists making GLaDOS. Obviously, she poisons everyone with neurotoxin. Anything here in the back? A secret? None. Okay, she she try, I remember this. She tries to bait us with the cake. And then I assume that's Doug with the companion cube behind the scenes. Okay, I destroy GLaDOS and I float to the air. And wait, why does he have the what is wait? Is this Doug? Pretty sure he didn't have the portal gun, right? Anyway. 
Ooh, this is the cover, the cover photo for Labrat, pretty sure. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow, I didn't even see it. Boop. Already loving this game so far. I love, like, the apocalyptic environment. Hmm. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal Already? military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics to share. <laughs> okay, one copy only for robots. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Yep. Ooh. Okay. We're doing... We're so far so good, guys. We're doing good. We're solving the puzzles. Trying to get the dialogue. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Hey! Okay. Yep. Should have known every every single thing. Wait, how is this dangerous? How is this test dangerous? It's not. It's easy. Put a portal here. Boom. Yeah. Oh, that's probably why you guys were saying this was a tutorial, because it literally is. It's the same puzzles. Can I still get rid of the camera? Oh, yes, I can. He's not mad at me, too. Okay. Let's get this cube first. Boom. Then place it up here, or down here, I mean. And then... Go up here, place a portal, pick it up, and we're good. Great work. Damn, I'm so smart. Any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. <laughs> I hate you guys. I hate you. Can't even give me a compliment. Are we supposed to go here? Okay, let me check upstairs. What is this first? Okay, Doug's hiding place. Unreason. Ah. Okay, so it's not. It's basically nothing. It's just a regular room. Man, we are zooming through the levels. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Yep. I agree. I agree. I don't remember this, though. This is new. Okay, so we enter from here. Yeah, this is definitely a new one. What is this? Cube? So we have cube. Can I put a portal down? Yep. Place it here. Okay. Am I supposed to... How am I supposed to pick that up? Clearly I can't, right? Yeah, I can't. Okay. Okay. There's another button there, I think. Yep. Let me see what it does. Okay, what does that do? That lifts the thing? What about this one? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So what if I do this? Boom. And catch it? Is it gonna... Oh, okay. Okay, I think I know what to do. I need to press this one, wait for it, and then boom. Come on, come on. Okay, nice. Good job, good job. 
I'm so smart, Maki. You're so smart. Oh my god! Well done. The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1. What? Dude, that 1.1 volts? That's basically nothing, dude. The entire facility. Oh my god. They could do that, but they can't make a nice robot who wouldn't kill them? This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, relax, buddy. Uh, momentum, momentum. So, sp speedy thing goes in, speedy thing goes out. Heck yeah. Okay, so we can't. Can I shoot a portal down here? Uh, okay. Supposed to jump down, I assume. Bang! If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future. And true. Science is the future. Yep. That is true. I... I could agree with that. Okay, this is... Over here? Jump. Boom. We get the cube. Now, how are we going to place the cube? Can I, like, just... Uh. Okay, I kind of fucked up there. Is it, like, the companion cube thing where I could just, like... Climb up. Okay, so I can't. Uh, over here. And then jump down, I guess. Will I actually reach that? I might, right? Let me just test it out. Okay, good. I didn't leave the cube behind. Because in the first game, I actually like dropped it. The radio, too. Okay, we gotta go. Gotta go to it again. Am I doing it right? Yeah, okay. I'm just overthinking, I'm sorry. Good work getting this far, future starter. Heck yeah. I'm the future. Simple minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you. Please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone <laughs> qualified for testing. That's so this guy's so stupid. I would actually argue he's kinda catching up to Gladys' humor. He's funny too, I'm not gonna lie. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey! Oi, oi! I'm up here! Hello, Wheatley. Oh, brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, the... Do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Uh... Portal on that wall behind <laughs> me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay. Easy. Wait, is there anything else in this room? Come on through. You're gonna say anything else? Come on through to the other side. Okay, you're saying the same thing, Wheatley. You're good, you're Please, good. Let me lay something on you here, it's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail, or I would die. But we're out of options here. Oh yeah, so your railing is out. Me, all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? Okay, I'm ready. One, I'm ready. Two. Three! That's high. It's, it's too high, isn't it? Really? <laughs> this is jump, bro. I got you. I got you. Let's, uh, I got you. I got you. I got you. Trust me. Trust me. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me, catch me. Ow. Wait, what? Ow. I... I'm I tried to catch dead. him. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed. Why does he sound so familiar, though? Over here? Um. Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, oh. I'm not, I'm not joking. Could you just turn around for a second? Someone's a bit shy. Okay, can I, like... All right, you can oh, damn, I missed it. Bam. Secret panel. Nice. 
while your back was turned. And off we go. Good job, Wheelie. Look at this. No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, Just follow the rail, actually. <laughs> okay, dude. So, you mean to tell me that you got off the rail just to follow the rail? Oh, no. Yes. Hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Is it going to shoot us? No. Thanks, we're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. Can I, like, sneak past it? Hello? Oh, you're different. Hey. I don't believe you, but okay. Man, we are zooming through the levels. This is insane. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber. And she will probably kill us if, if she's her. awake. If you want to just call it quits, and we could just sit here forever. That's an option. option okay. Sit here, do option <laughs> okay. Go through there. And if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. So, if you've got any reservations, what's Oh, no. Now would be a tremendous time to voice them. I, I right. know. I know. I remember this. Oh my god. Okay. No way. Is she alive? I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. Here we go. Yeah, I dude, I smoked and rolled her, dude. Look at this place. I destroyed it. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down? In the end? Me. You're not gonna believe this. A human. It's I me. I, I did it. Either. Apparently, this human escaped, and uh, nobody's seen him since. Him. A long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened, and then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch him. Is he talking about Doug? For sure. What is? She looks kind of different. Pretty sure she was a bit more rounded, right? I swear. Oh, look at this. Dude, she got I, she got wrecked. I'm sorry. Can I still see the thing? Oh, wow. I'm stuck. Okay. Incinerator. So, it's open now? Okay, down these stairs. Jump! This, actually, look at it. That is quite a, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Am I gonna get... Okay, well, I don't have fall damage. Go ahead and jump. You've got you've got braces on your legs, so you're all set. Although no braces on your arms, though. So <laughs> you're gonna have to rely on the old human strength to keep. A grip I got a good grip. I got a good grip. And by extension, me. So do do really make sure you keep a grip on me. Yep. Yep. So a note: no braces on your spine either. So okay. Yeah. Split like a melon from this height. <laughs> um, so do definitely. Oh my god, dude! I'm dead. Us. Jesus. Can I, quick question. Have you been working out? Because, I'll be honest, there's no evidence of it. You know, I'm not, I'm not like just a plastic cup. Uh, we will be landing with some force. So, uh, oh my god, you know, dude. Oh, fuck. I'm teary-eyed. Holy shit. Right, let's go. Jump. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, oh I just thought about the worst thing that could happen. Now. Oh, I just thought of something even worse. Plan, a new plan. No imagining of any potential outcome. Yep, whatsoever. it's true. It's, it's in the mind. It's the mindset. And let's see what happens. Oh, it's still there. It's still in my head. <laughs> oh my god, I kicked my camera. Oh god. Oh my god. Did I mess up my thing? Okay. Sorry about that. I might have kicked the camera. I just had to check. Oh my god. I'm dead. Ah! Still held. Still being held. You that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. I've been working out. That's me. That's me, man. Ah, I just, sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah, I've just done it again. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I keep laughing literally every five minutes this because this shit is so... Is the main breaker room. <sighs> Look for a switch that says escape pod. Okay. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Okay, escape pod. Don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something, it doesn't say escape pod. Look at something else. Look at the How am I going to find it over don't here? Or look at well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. I do, I do. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. How are you even gonna see escape pod? 
Yeah, there's no way I'm seeing escape pod. You go ahead, Wheatley. Let there be light. That's uh, gold. God, yeah. Gold. Oh, look at that. Whoa, that is trippy. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. No. Escape pod, escape pod. Where is it? Okay. Oh. Okay. No, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it. I've got uh oh. It. This should slow it down. No, it makes it go faster. <laughs> uh oh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right. Oh my god. Please. Uh, what a. Bro. 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 Stop. <laughs> Bro. Oh, I'm dead. I fucked up. A, 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 um, Bro. <laughs> You forgot the B. Wait, did I do B? Did I do B? <laughs> oh my god. Well, it's you. Oh my god. Yeah. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Oh fuck, she's mad. She's actually mad. No, 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 no. <laughs> We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. Oh, she should. Wheatley, no! What the fuck? You monster. Oh, you're so evil. They attached me to Wheatley and then killed him. You must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Oh no, I got an achievement. You monster reunite with GLaDOS. <laughs> Fuck man, she's alive again. Oh no, this is bad. Wait, this is a deep incinerator. Whoa. I'm... Am I in hell? The incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. Oh my god. The evil portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Oh, I'm not sure about that. Alright guys, that is going to be it for this episode. A lot literally happened in what I assume to be like 30-40 minutes. And it's crazy. She is back, guys. She's back. I don't know what to do. I almost barely made it out last time. And now we are back into the abyss where she's going to try to kill us and probably get revenge. Because she's... I could tell, like, she she's really mad. But yeah, so far, I am enjoying this game. It's already showing signs of promise that I, I'm starting to get some of your insights on why this game is actually better in terms of dialogue there is already there is a lot of dialogue and there seems to be like a story behind it like a bigger more linear kind of story compared to like the first one in terms of the graphics too i'm pretty sure they kind of upgraded some of the graphics here they look way way better than the previous game either that or i'm just literally you know in this kind of placebo effect where i know i know it's the second game so they must have improved the graphics right so please tell me in the comment sections if i'm wrong or if there's anything that i need to know so yeah if you enjoyed the video please leave a like or comment down below some of your thoughts on what you liked about the episode what you like about the game some of your thoughts on the editing if there's any feedback on where i can improve as a creator feel free to let me know and also, please, no spoilers, no hinting. You, you guys know the rest. You guys you're, you guys are smart. I know you guys. You know what should you should be commenting and what you shouldn't be commenting. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.